hello everyone welcome to this video in this video we are actually going to see that how can you fix a hundred percent cpu usage in your system so hundred percent cpu usage is a very common problem and its effects include that your system may hang and you might not be able to do the tasks that you want to do so this is actually a very common problem and its solution is also very simple so in this video we are going to see the solution without any further ado let us just dive right into the solution so the first step that you need to do is you need to right click on the start button and select device manager from the options in the device manager this kind of a dialog box will open so you have to search for system devices this option that says system devices just expand it once you have expanded it, you can see so many system devices. Let us just scroll down and search for something that says high precision event type. Once you have found it, just right click over here and here you will find different options. So what you may need to do is disable this device. So just click on disable device. Once you have done this, then you can close this dialog box. So this is the first step. Actually, this is a three step process that we need to do in order to ensure that the high CPU utilization is fixed. The first step we have done that is completed. Now let us just go to the second step. Go to the search bar and just search for power. So edit power plan in the control panel is what we are looking for. So once it is showing on your screen, just click on there and go to this particular option. This kind of a dialog box would be appearing in front of you. Here you will see that um, what is the display of time and the computer sleep time when it is on a battery or when it is on plugged in mode we are not concerned with that we are concerned with the change advanced power settings so if you click on this this advanced settings dialog box will appear in front of you these are some of the default options that you will get and you will see that the option or the mode is selected to balanced if you just click over here you will find some more options i'm not getting it right now because i have uh, this only setting in my machine but you will get some other options like high power or uh, best performance options so out of the options just select the option that says the best performance if you are not happy with these settings you can always click on restore plan defaults so all the default settings of that particular plan would be restored so that if you have made any changes that won't be applied but from here you need to just select for a best performance mode once you have selected it just click on apply and click on ok this is the second step the third step is the startup applications so many a times what happens is there are some default applications that get started up automatically when our computer boots up and that causes a high cpu utilization issue because those applications get keep eating our cpu so to solve this issue we are just going to right click on the task bar and go to the task manager here you will see right now I'm getting all these uh, apps that are working for me. So 58%, 57% CPU utilization I'm getting. Uh, this one application is eating around 25% of my CPU. And rest of the CPU is being utilized by the screen capturing device or, uh, application that I'm using currently. And task manager is capturing somewhat of a 0.5% uh, of my CPU. Then there is another application anti-malware service executable that is also taking some of my CPU. But this is not of our concern right now because my CPU is at a normal performance like 25%, 26%, that's normal. So if you just go to startup, this will show you the applications that are actually getting automatically started whenever the computer boots, whenever your system boots and these take up the CPU. So what you can do, you can identify the applications over here that are no longer required or that you think are harmful and you can disable them right now if you see in the status enabled i have adobe collaboration i have apps pointing device driver i have microsoft onedrive phone link and windows security notification so according to me all these five applications are actually important that these should actually run when my system is starting so i'm not going to disable any of them these five also if you are showing on your system do not disable them if you see any of the applications that you think are useless then you can disable those 
so that is how you fix the 100% cpu utilization issue very easily onto your system that's it for this video thanks for watching